uh, sitting as chair. Distinguished colleagues, thank you, Mr. Chairman, for yielding the floor to me. I thought when the chairman of appropriations spoke, it was as clear as crystals that there was a misunderstanding of the figures. When he came up with the GOEs and all the agencies on first-line charge, there is no difference between the figure he reeled out and the figure purported to be padded. I thought with that, that matter would have been rested by Senator Ningi saying that this three point something billion, uh, trillion was not part of the budgetary provisions printed out for us. That would have settled this matter. We are going forth and back on these issues and coming up with issues of the budget and individual uh, issues concerning what came to our various constituencies. If we want to go into those issues, all of us are called people. Some senators here, so-called senior senators, got 500 million each. I am a ranking senator, I didn't get. Did I go to the press? Most of you got. And yes, if we want to go into those issues, excuse me, if we want to go into those issues, yes. So I think that, I think that, I think that Senator Ningi, Senator Ningi, I'm seeing about it again. I know I'm trying to from where. I'm going to go 
You can see what we are saying. Yes, so that is how they behave. That is Mama how Sinus. they behave. Nigeria senators sharing the money, sharing the money, 500 million naira per senator. <laughs> and the poor people cannot even buy gari and eat. Yet, they hypnotize you to the extent of believing in them. Criminals hypnotize you, whether they blew it on air. And you, you, you breathe it in, and your brain is resetting or something. I don't know how they, how they have done this to Nigerians. Some people are still saying, "Pray for Nigeria, pray for Nigeria." How many years will you pray for Nigeria? Why can't you do some other things different from what you used to do, to see if something can change? Why are you still saying pray for Nigeria? Eh? Well. That's how they are sharing it. Remember, none will come to you. Hmm? None will come to me. So keep believing in what does not concern you. That is height of foolishness. Foolishness to the, in the highest order. That's what it is. Whether you like it or not, you are, if you are believing in Nigeria, you are exhibiting highest rank of foolishness. Because they don't know you and they don't care about you. What they do is what concerns them. What they do is what makes them richer. What they do is how to cover up these loopholes and lies. That's what they do. They lobby nations in order to, for them to keep quiet and never put hand in division of Nigeria. Because division of Nigeria is division of their business, division of their money, division of, uh, in fact, I don't even know. But then, you can see things yourself. If you say the truth in Senate House, you are shut up. And the noise, noise, they will not allow you to talk again because they are dodging the camera. You know, whatever camera captures uh, will hardly be deleted because so many fools must have carried it already. So it will be there perpetually. That's why they don't like that truth that will be said uh, before the camera. You know, and that is it. Help us to share, help us to like, help us to subscribe. God bless you.